Hi, in this problem, we're going to find the limit as phi approaches pi of phi times the secant of phi. So the first thing we're going to do in this problem is maybe write this in a way that's a little bit more convenient. So recall that the secant of phi is equal to 1 divided by cosine of phi. So we'll start this problem by rewriting the trig function. So this is the limit as phi approaches pi of phi times 1 over cosine of phi. Again, just rewriting the secant function as 1 over cosine. Okay, now we can go ahead and plug in pi. So when we plug in the number, we're basically taking the limit. So we drop the limit sign. So this is pi times 1 over cosine of pi. This is equal to pi times 1 over, and cosine of pi is negative 1. That's because on the unit circle, every ordered pair is of the form cosine theta sine theta. And so at pi, which is here, the x coordinate is negative 1. And cosine is the x coordinate on the unit circle. So at pi, the x coordinate is negative 1. So the cosine of pi is negative 1. This is pi times negative 1, which is equal to negative pi. And that would be the final answer. I hope this video has been helpful to someone out there who is learning some math. Good luck.